It's not exactly the best neighborhood in Dallas. For many who grew up in Oak Cliff, the goal was always to move out. But a new program is changing the cycle, offering a can't miss opportunity that's making young people proud of where their home neighborhood is. Damon Fernandez shows us in this WFAA original. These are, these are my roots. Sunset Hills. But everybody used to gather here. It used to be long lines, probably till over there, sometimes across the street. Gregory Cabello says there's a sense of community pride in this area of Oak Cliff. Though growing up here was tough. There were some dynamics around the neighborhood that you wanted to escape. Oh, definitely. Uh, street violence, gun violence, um, a lot of dynamics. Some painful memories are now motivating Gregory to create positive change in his own life while potentially staying in Oak Cliff to make the neighborhood better. Yeah, my friend uh, Joshua, he actually passed away about two years ago. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, he wanted to be an RN. Um, fortunately, he wasn't able to reach that goal, but as a, as a friend, I felt like I felt the need to kind of go down that path the medical field. Nephro is um, each week kidney. Gregory is part of a small group of students working with patients and staff at Methodist Charlton. Miss Harvey. They're part of an initiative called Oak Cliff Works. Yeah. The program is making good. career training available All to right. people who want it. It should take like five minutes. I think it is a game changer because what well, provides uh, people in the lower uh, lower middle class to be able to have an opportunity to join the program without having to pay anything, uh, wor worried about finances. They call it the Southern Sector Connector. <laughs> it's teaming with Oak Cliff based businesses to bring opportunities Opportunities like this to people in their own neighborhood. Yes, and I've been taking care of people all my life. Erica Frierson is another student in the health care program. Miss Mary, we're going to go ahead and change your bed. Will that be okay? All right, I guess she says okay. <laughs> Erica was a longtime caregiver for her mom and already had experience as a certified nurse's right. assistant. Let's warm his hand up because it's kind of cold. She says this program is helping her advance. All right. I wanted to sharpen my skills because they have like, you know, new technology and I wanted to be able to keep up my skills so that I can help the patients. The training through Oak Cliff Works is intense. At this hospital, instructors say it goes far beyond a patient's physical needs. Hi, Ms. Michaela. We're teaching them also how to take care of the spiritual, the holistic needs, uh, the emotional needs that comes with it patient being in the hospital. <laughs> Good, you got it. Oak Cliff Works is tackling challenges in areas impacted by poverty, poor education, and inadequate transportation. There are pockets of um, poverty well, all over the city, but in particularly in the southern sector, there are some areas in which individuals are not making more than $11,000 a year. You know how to put the volume up on the yeah. TV? Okay. Sounds good. Thank the you program so is designed to change the dynamics. Call us if you need us, okay? It positions people who want to stay in their community a chance to have a career they can be proud of. <laughs> and me getting them to smile and feel good after I've done, that makes me feel good, confidence, and knowing that I know what I'm doing. I'm bringing my love to the table and my compassion. Just like Erica Frierson, Gregory says he also wants more for himself and his family. How I grew up here in Oak Cliff, um, we started, we, we came from nothing, to be honest. Nothing in the refrigerator, you know, you kind of want to just break that chain, uh, that paycheck to paycheck lifestyle, and you want to become something in life. He's also doing something meaningful in his friend's memory. All right, thank you so much, Mr. Jones. Damon Fernandez, Channel 8 News. <laughs> Oak Cliff Works offers a variety of free career training resources. To learn more about their programs, just click on Damon's story on WFAA.com.